I'm gonna take a look at an extremely rare wrestling game straight out of Japan Fire Pro Wrestling Iron Slam 96 and it literally is out of Japan I had to import this one I've been looking for it on the internet for quite a while but I just gave up and decided to go ahead and look on eBay even on eBay it's pretty hard to find but I found me a copy I dropped about 20 bucks on this I really only knew about this game for about a month now I was looking on Wikipedia and I found some information on all the Fire Pro Wrestling games ever released and there was a couple there I never even knew about this one being one of them so this game came out back in 1996 bearing that in mind I thought there was a really good chance this game was gonna suck but I'm such a fan of the series I bought this game really just because I wanted to see how the 3D attempt came out so let me go ahead and get into the game already well for starters let me compare it to some of the other Fire Pro Wrestling games. Now just before it came Super Fire Pro Wrestling X Premium which was released in 1995 for the Super Nintendo and the same year when this came out we saw Fire Pro Wrestling S Six Man Scramble on the Sega Saturn. Now those were two great and very complex wrestling games way ahead of their time. This is a more straightforward approach to a wrestling game and by that I mean there is no edit mode that means you cannot create a player the game doesn't have very many characters in fact the game itself doesn't have much depth at all this game is so simple and straightforward it's almost like an arcade game now the great thing about those other Fire Pro Wrestling games is they have a ton of features plenty of modes basically just tons of replay value but this game there's just so little to do you really only have circuit mode which is one on one against every character and exhibition mode which is just one on one and the opponent you choose that's it there's no tag team gruesome match cage match none of that crap is here it's just simple one on one action so the game has 10 selectable characters and there's also a boss character but I don't even know if you can play as him and each character has their own fighting style and assortment of moves which is definitely a redeeming quality in this game now if you're wondering how the control works it's pretty much exactly the same as the other Fire Pro Wrestling games but that's what makes it Fire Pro Wrestling the grappling system still uses the timing strategy which I still think is the best grappling system you're gonna find in any wrestling game unfortunately though the control is still a little clunky and stiff but definitely better than a game like WCW vs the world which was a goddamn struggle to move your wrestler around so some of you may be aware that WCW vs the world was actually released in Japan as Virtual Pro Wrestling in 1996 so Virtual Pro Wrestling and this game came out in the same year but I'll tell you I definitely prefer this game because of the engine it moves a lot faster and it's a lot more functional now Virtual Pro Wrestling and Fire Pro Wrestling 96 are some early 3D wrestling games but they're not the first ones the first 3D wrestling game came out in 1995 for the PlayStation and it was called Tokan Retsuden and Tukan Retsuden is actually a series developed by Yukes who are the developers of many other crappy wrestling games that we have out now I ordered one and two of that series from eBay hopefully they'll be in soon so I can review them as well but anyway let me go ahead and wrap up this review so my expectations weren't too high for this game and with that said it blew them away now this game doesn't have the depth or complexity of a lot of the wrestling games we have today but from when it came out it's definitely pretty damn fun but while I play this definitely it comes to mind why wouldn't I play Super Fire Pro Wrestling X Premium or Fire Pro Wrestling S Six Man Scramble over this really 3D graphics is the only thing this game offers that you won't find in the other ones so I give this game a C it's fun but there were better Fire Pro Wrestling games out at the time it's too bad this is the only 3D Fire Pro Wrestling game because it has problems but it could have developed into something great